Hey guys, TVG here with another episode of TVG News. Today we'll be focusing on an article written on April 30th, 2023 by Yahoo News and Associated Press. Let's take a look. The dumbest man alive, not the sharpest tool in the shed. Scary man arrested after three mil worth of drugs shipped to restaurant. Let's continue. Auburn, Maine AP. Employees of a Maine restaurant got a surprise when they opened a large wooden crate that they thought was a shipment of mugs they had recently ordered. Instead, they found a plastic tote that contained what law enforcement suspects is 14 kilograms, 31 pounds, of the powerful synthetic opioid fentanyl with an estimated street value of $3 million. Auburn Police Deputy Chief Timothy Kugel said in a statement Saturday, the tote had a shipping label with the restaurant's address, but the name of someone who didn't work there. Employees who opened it saw what they thought looked like drugs, so they contacted police, Kugel said. All right, we got employees. Good job, guys. And Kugel, right on it, man. Thank you. Good job. The crate from Arizona that arrived in the main town about 30 miles, 50 kilometers north of Portland, was taken to the police department, where a chemical field examination confirmed it contained fentanyl. Fentanyl. Bad, bad, bad. About an hour later, the man whose name was on the shipment showed up looking for the crate and was arrested, police said. Just wanted to let you guys know, this crime should be punishable by stoning. This should be life in prison with no chance or possibility of parole. This should be jail, prison, hard time. Doing all the jail things, bending over to pick up the soap in the shower, etc. He should be getting the whole nine yards. No pun intended. I mean it. The whole nine, literally. Let's continue. Jeremy Mercier, 41, of Auburn, was charged with drug offenses and violating bail conditions. He's being held in a county jail without bail. It could not be determined if he had an attorney. Let's continue. Mercier previously spent time behind bars on a 2007 federal drug conviction, Kugel said. The investigation is ongoing, and Kugel said he anticipates state and federal law enforcement getting involved. So this all had to happen very quickly. Great timing. And Kugel was right on it because this guy one hour later came and they arrested him. He thought he would outsmart everybody. He went to the restaurant. He thought he'd mix it in there with all the other packages. No one would know. And he would outsmart everybody. He sends it to a commercial business that he has no affiliation with? What a moron. <laughs> what a schmuck. Holy moly, wow. He's not too bright. The deadliest man-made drug in the history of the world. It's designed to kill. It's designed to take people out. Take a look at this guy. Take a close look at this piece of shit. These are the type of people that need to be taken off the streets. Dumb, addicted, living in the fast lane, and desperate willing to take another person's life without blinking an eye off the streets great work great work great job kugel and your team all law enforcement involved great job we really appreciate it okay guys leave a comment down below and let me know what you think that's gonna do it for today's episode if you like this video please give it an old thumbs up Subscribe to the channel if you're not already, and share it with a friend if possible. Thanks for watching, I really appreciate it, and I'll see you in the next one. TVG, out.